Hey everyone, I hope you're having a great day. Today I have another bullet journal plan with me for you guys. I know I haven't done an Erin Condren plan with me in quite a while, but next week I'm gonna do a bonus Erin Condren video. I have just been in a creative kick lately, so I've been really enjoying the bullet journal and all of my other like journals where I can write a little bit more. So we just finished with the Black Friday sale and yesterday was Small Business Saturday and I did a promotion where one of the freebies was this like hand-lettered days of the week sticker sheet. I used my own hand-lettered stickers for the week before, um, but for this plan with me, I didn't think that you guys would want to see me put stickers down of my own handwriting, so I just decided to hand-letter it for you guys. The brush pen is a Tombow Fudenosuke, and the gel pen that I'm using is the Energel Kleina pen. I basically divided up the page so I had enough space for 7 days worth of plans and also just enough space at the bottom to fit in a piece of washi, so I chose the Stitch and Friends washi from my shop. This one is super cool because it kind of has a bluish silver foil, uh, but anyways, after I put down that strip, I also wrote down the dates and I split off each day with just a simple line. You guys know me, I rarely use rulers, it's just too much effort um, and I really do like the hand-drawn look. So now that the base of the week is complete, I go into each day and fill in all of my plans, which is my favorite part. I generally just make tons of to-do lists and if something is a little bit more notable or important, then I'll use a sticker or I'll use highlighters to uh, just draw attention to that. So Monday, which is actually tomorrow, is Cyber Monday, which I'm currently getting ready for. If you're interested, tomorrow I will be doing a Cyber Monday sale and also a digital printables release. Um, and I will have all of the information up in the Facebook group. But anyways, I just used this celebrating emoji head to mark that. And I also am going to be having a quiz tomorrow, so I put down the silver foil pencil sticker from The Giving Girl and used my highlighter to write it in. Also, I put down this panda paperclip sticker from my shop to mark in that I wanted to start my finals prep. My first final is actually this coming Saturday, which is just so crazy to me. I've never had an exam on a weekend. Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit upset about that, but it's okay, just get all of my finals done and I can go home for the holidays. Anyways, for Tuesday, I just wrote down another to-do list and I also put down this quarter box sticker from the Fox and Pip to mark in that I will be having a library day, again, just studying for my finals. I'm going to have another quiz on Tuesday, so I just once again use my highlighter and I put down this new Disney Plus emoji from my shop to mark in that I'm probably going to watch tons of Disney Plus and also sign the postcards for the calendars. Moving on to Wednesday, I put down an unplug emoji to mark in that I wanted to just take it a little bit easy on that day. Um, I still do have tons of things to do, so I still made a to-do list and I put down a phone sticker to mark in that I wanted to call one of the people that I work with. I just drew in a little stitched flag and underneath I put down another library sticker from Willow Willow Co. to mark in that, of course, I want to go to the library. Moving on to Thursday, I wrote down another to-do list. My life is not very interesting. Um, I also marked in that I'm going to have another quiz. The girl sticker is from Odd Loop. And then basically beside my to-do list, I made another to-do list for school. I did put down a cupcake sticker from Two Little Bees and hand-lettered in cupcake because there's this really cute cupcake place that I pass by every time I go grocery shopping and I'm not honestly too interested in cupcakes but it just looks really good so I might try it on Thursday. Anyways, for Friday, I put down a computer sticker from Willow Willow Co. and marked in that I wanted to finish just all of the practice tests that I have within my reach so I can just cover all grounds. And I also put down a backpack sticker from Dizzy Daisy Dreams to give me a little reminder of some things to do before an exam. One time I forgot my calculator and thank goodness I left early so I could go all the way back home and go back to the exam center and I still had time. So yeah, since then, I always make a little checklist of things that I have to bring. Um, yeah, that's about it for this plan with me. It was pretty quick. I hope you enjoyed watching me plan for next week and hopefully I'll be back with more plan with me next week. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys soon. Bye guys!